Time now. Jersey now has some of the fastest broadband speeds in the world after the installation of a full fibre connection to 40,000 homes and businesses. So many properties on the island are now directly connected to the network, meaning that they have guaranteed high speeds. Well, our technology correspondent, Rory Catherine Jones, is in Jersey for us this morning. Now, uh, we promised some lovely views, didn't we, Rory? And you're finally getting them now. That now the sun has broken. Um, tell us about what's happening there. Yeah, the sun's come up. Carol's got a castle. We've got our own castle here. That's Elizabeth Castle, you can see. Uh, offshore, it's a high, high tide at the moment, so I'd have to swim to get out there. At low tide, you can walk along uh, the causeway. We did that yesterday. And along that causeway is running the fibre optic cable that brings fast broadband, not just to the castle, but just to, to just about everywhere on the island. They've dug up country roads, they've dug up streets, they brought it to every home, 40,000 homes uh, a, a, across the island, 100% availability of fibre to the home. Now that compares with just 5% in the UK where it's set to become quite standard. And Jersey thinks we can all learn a lot from what's happened on this island. They've all got it, from a castle where it arrives down a causeway which is underwater at high tide. Come on in ladies, laptops out. To a girls school where all students and teachers rely on it in lessons. To the farm where these Jersey cows are arriving at a high tech milking parlour. Yes, they've all got fast fibre broadband now available everywhere on the island. That's because Jersey has gone down a different route from the UK, taking fibre right into the home rather than relying on a copper cable for the last stretch. In the UK, the fibre is typically connected to a cabinet, a green cabinet in your street close to your home. It's as if a motorway is being built to the bottom of your road, whereas in Jersey, we're actually building the motorway all the way into your home. The hope is that having a future-proofed broadband connection will help all kinds of businesses, like Lodge Farm with its 200 dairy cattle. This may look like an old-fashioned kind of business, but it is benefiting from the fast fibre because each of these cows is effectively online, sending data to the cloud. This afternoon she has given just over eight litres of milk. The cows are sending data not just to the farm's computers, but to a company in the UK monitoring the performance of the milking equipment. It's definitely improved our profitability and our productivity. Um, as problems arise, we can sort them out within seconds. At Beaulieu School, every pupil has a small laptop connected to the fast Wi-Fi network. As you can see on your Google Classroom, you are going to be working in um, groups, OK, small groups. All the lessons are stored online, accessible at home as well as at school. And the whole system is now cheaper to run. It makes a huge difference um, compared to schools that I've been in in the past. The amount of time that is saved, um, not only for myself in planning and printing kind of time, but the access that the students have is just so quick and it's so instant that you can put something on their Google Classroom and they've got it there straight away in front of them. They can start engaging um, immediately, which is fantastic. It hasn't been cheap to dig up the roads and lay fibre optic cables everywhere. But with the main telecoms company owned by the island's government, they've been able to take a long-term view. Now Jersey thinks it can teach the rest of us a few lessons about the fast fibre future. Now it's not that cheap for the, for the users, about £40 a month for the full broadband service. And you can't get a cheaper service uh, because the copper network is being switched off, the old fashioned way of getting broadband. But they think they've got lessons for the whole of the UK, which is racing really to ca catch up. The government has said this is a priority, everybody needs full fibre broadband, it's becoming essential uh, in the 21st century. Rory, thanks very much. Sounds fascinating, doesn't it? Lots of uh, people with access to that now. Yeah, Jersey uh, way ahead of the pack uh, compared to a lot of places. Uh, more on that later on. 7.28 the time, we'll have uh, the news.